Hi everybody, I wanted to take a minute to go over a story with you that I found in the news today. So Steve Easterbrook was the former CEO of McDonald's and he resigned, was asked to step down by the board of directors of McDonald's because of having an affair with one of the employees, which is a big no-no for that company and a lot of companies. So I wanted to take a look at his flying stars to see if there was anything that would indicate something like this happening for him because usually there are and in his case it's true too so for the year steve has there are a couple of different directions where the stars are are showing issues if if you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing. In other words, it's kind of like the universe holding you accountable. So if you've been doing everything you're supposed to do, when stars come in that are difficult, it can create like little issues for you, but you're not gonna have big, big disastrous problems. When you haven't been doing what you're supposed to do, you know, following the golden rule or, you know, behaving yourself, when these negative stars come in or more difficult stars come in, then that's when it kind of blows up in your face and that's pretty much what happened this year so for steve he had the disaster star sitting on his relationship direction this year and his relationship direction is specifically tied to relationships with a partner so one other person it's also tied to marriage he happens to be divorced but this can also be relationships with somebody that you're dating so Disaster on um, relationships means problems, problems with relationships. But again, if you're talking things out, if you're working things through, if you're doing what you're supposed to do, then this, this is kind of like, well, how do we fix it kind of year? But when you're doing something you're not supposed to do, like having an affair with an employee, that's, that's problematic. And for the month, he actually had this star doubled. So there's a monthly star that comes into every area of your life um, in addition to the yearly star, and that can make things better for you, or it can kind of neutralize things, or it can make things more challenging. So with a double disaster star sitting in his relationship direction for the month, that was an indication that, that this was gonna blow up in his face. And the particular star that sat that sits in his relationship direction uh, for this particular situation is the star of fame. So that can put you in the spotlight with regard to problems with your relationships, which this obviously has. Um, for his career direction, he has the new beginning star, which means that you can start something new. Doesn't mean you have to change your job. It can be that you take on a new position or you take on additional responsibilities or different responsibilities. But again, if you're not doing what you're supposed to do, it can mean that you're asked to leave and now you have to start a new career. That's what's going to, that's what happened in the case with Steve. Um, the other thing that uh, is facing him, was facing him for the month is, let me take a look here. Yeah, he had the disaster star sitting on his career for the month. So the new beginning star with the disaster star means problems that are going to make you have to start over make you have to do things over again or start something new or in this case you know you get kicked out of your job and now you got to find another job um for his wisdom direction which happens to do happens to be tied to like what you're thinking about and decisions that you're making for yourself uh it can be for other people but it's also for you was that he would be making poor decisions this year or would be struggling with decisions that he was making this year so it could be that before he entered into this relationship and we don't know how long the relationship went on because that information hasn't been made available yet that he was thinking this is probably a bad idea so he should have trusted his gut in this case and and he didn't and then for the month he had the star of sudden events so Poor relationships create sudden, and with the sudden events, you know, it's like all of this came to a head. Disaster on his relationships, disaster on his career and having to start over, poor choices, and then having that suddenly blow up in your face. That, that's all has what can't, is, it's all what came together this month for him and resulted in him having to resign and the board of directors, um, asking him to leave McDonald's. So 
just how another way flying stars can point to problems, it can point to solutions, it can give you, it gives you guidance. So the, what I say with regard to flying stars is timing is everything. Because if the timing is good, the, the stars work with you. If the timing is not great or if the stars aren't great, then you need to step back and reevaluate things. You know, there's a time when you need to um, think, think and plan. And some of these stars are telling you, hey, this year we want you to think and plan with these areas. It's not that it has to be every year like that. Some years are go, go, go. But, you know, like with the cycle of life, you need time to time for a break and time to take take a step back. And then you can move forward once you've had a chance to kind of regroup, to plan, to rest, to relax. Then you can go again. So this was not the year to go for him. This was a year that he should have step, done a step back, taken a look at his life, at his relationships, at his career, and kind of reevaluated what he wanted to do. Um, so this particular affair was not, not a good choice for him, and especially not this year. Even if he had it last year, this is the year that would have blown up for him. So you really kind of have to think about what you're doing and when you're doing it. And the flying stars tell you that they, they, it's like, Hey, we're here. We're telling you, you don't even have to guess. We're, we've got the information. We're telling you upfront and personal, this is what you need to be doing this year. So that's why I love that information. That's why I love consulting with my clients because it actually helps them. They can use, it's like, it's like having control over your life. So if you find this helpful, Press like down below and please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Just click the subscribe button and then also hit the bell and you'll be notified anytime I put up a new video. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.